Here they come. And they're off, and that is Columbia Nipper driving for the lead from the outside. Broadway Spirit along the inside. Lefe is in along the rail, racing away in third. And then it is Falcon Dakota completing the first four, followed by Kilty Hanover and Don't Get In My Way settles down at the back of the pack. They round the clubhouse turn, go to the back stretch, and that is Columbia Nipper taking the early lead. Broadway Spirit racing second. Lefe is in third, and uh, then along the inside, Falcon Dakota completes the first four. Back to Kilty Hanover and Don't Get In My Way trails the field. Opening quarter of a mile was clocked in 28 and 2. And uh, as they race up the back stretch, Dave McGee and Columbia Nipper are in complete control of the pace. Now, Broadway Spirit is inching closer from second, half in, half out. Dale Heitman looking to move with Broadway Spirit. Lefe is at the rail racing in third. Falcon Dakota completes the first four. Kilty Hanover's revving up from fifth, and the trailer is don't get in my way. Half time behind the lead of Columbia Nipper in 57 and 4. They start around the far turn. There's been very little change. No action on as of yet. Now Falcon Dakota's the first to move to the outside, going after Columbia Nipper. Columbia Nipper still has the lead. Broadway Spirit along the inside, up on the outside, Falcon Dakota. And then along the inside, Lefe is shuffled back in fourth. Kilty Hanover's on the outside, fifth. Don't get in my way, trails the field. Three in, three out. They're coming to the top of the home stretch behind the lead of Columbia Nipper. Falcon Dakota ready to pounce from the outside is into second. Three quarters of a mile in 127 flat there homeward bound and a falcon dakota riding up to challenge columbia nipper on the outside kilty hanover's finishing fast center of the track don't get in my way into the final eighth of a mile columbia nipper holding tough columbia nipper falcon dakota they're battling it out kilty hanover finishing fast third it's columbia nipper the best in the invitational two weeks in a row